Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. Welcome back to some familiar environs. We're back in the main manor. Now, this is the point. This is the point at which the game really says, okay, you had some fun with the Zambros, with the giant snakes, with the doggies, uh, with the giant testicle monsters, but now it's time for things to get a little bit real. This is the point at which the game kicks off big style. The mansion is no longer just populated by zombies and the odd larger monster. Oh no. Oh no. Now, we're gonna have to deal with some of the nastier enemies in the game. This is where it ramps up, I'm afraid. And this is, when when we played this game as kids, when we played this game as teenagers, the original version, this is where we lost our shit. So, let's deal with these things, shall we? What's first? Oh yeah, I remember! <laughs> Huge scythe-clawed lizard things! Hunters! And yes, it is- Watch him thrash! Watch him thrash! Die! Die, damn- Oh, there's another one! Fuck! 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 I did not see that coming! Shit tits and ass, man! That, um, I did not know they could do that. That one leapt down from the upper balcony. That is so cool. These are fabulous enemies. I love the hunters. How can you not just adore the hunters? Now, we have the helmet key, which means that, oh yes, which means that some areas are going to be open now, and I know which areas they are. So, uh, I'm just going to pop back into our lovely little safe room with its lovely little music, and I'm going to pick up something rather necessary which is um this where are we now where is our grenade launcher because we're going to be needing that relatively soon yeah so we're about to meet an old friend and no it's not barry we don't need a grenade launcher for him yet much to my displeasure. Now, you see, I'm getting paranoid now. Every time we go past a window, I get paranoid because I can't quite remember what the game is going to chuck at us next. Click. Hello? Anyone enjoying a lovely, uh, a lovely warm drink by the fire there? It looks like there's something rather lovely there, actually. It's going to get very warm there. I hope it's port or brandy or something like that. Use the helmet key. Ah! New room. I, th I believe this is the library, if I remember correctly. Oh, shit. <gasps> no, I know what this is. Oh, this is a puzzle. This is a puzzle, and it's a pain in the fucking ass, quite frankly. Um, I remember doing this for the first time, and just get uh, on the GameCube, and just getting it totally wrong. Um, this is a new puzzle in the game, and leads to... A relatively new section. Now look, those walls are not going to crush us, fortunately, because of the statue. But what we've got to do is push this statue up here. Then we need to run back and reset the damn walls, which we do here, I believe. There's a switch here. Press it. Yes. Now we need to run like fucking buggery. <laughs> and now we need to run this way. Jill, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing? No, we fucked that up. You see what we need to do? We need to put the statue back, basically. So that's that's wrong. We need to be quicker than that. Um, that was my fault. Totally. Because I, I got a perspective thing wrong there. Yes, move, you arsehole woman. Now, hopefully, we've got it. I think we just might make this. Once we get it right, it clicks in automatically. Yes, there we go. Odd little puzzle, that one. Not in the original game. Is that, a, is that a, a Goya painting up there? If so, it's entirely appropriate, although it would fit much better in Silent Hill. What have we got here? 
Oh, health is shit. Why was that? What got us? I can't quite remember. Oh. Oh, fuck. If one thing is guaranteed to make you a little bit quibbly in a survival horror game, it's a big hole leading underground that looks like it was borrowed by something not human. That is not inviting at all. That is actually quite scary. Are we going to go down? Of course we are. You can't see very far into it, though. <laughs> yes. Oh, this was probably a bad idea. There's no way back up, either. This this was a stupid idea, Jill. You're stupid. Eagle of South and Wolf of the North. You remember... I, I, oh, look at, look at the, the cockroaches crawling over the wall. Isn't that cool? Just lovely little ambient details. That's what I love about this game. You probably noticed that all the way through. Uh, this is a puzzle as to... Um, what we need is two medals, the the eagle medal and the wolf medal. I believe one of them is in here. There we are, the eagle medal. Fabulous. Medal of eagle. Fabulous. Now, that um, is a key for later on. I won't be needing that for a while yet. Look at the bugs. Look at the little bugs. I love it. Gorgeous pre-rendered background. So what have we got here? What's this? I don't even know what this is. November 29th, 1967. Oh no, is this Trevor's diary again? The last part. I can't get out. I have tried every possible way to escape, but only to be faced with the reality that I'm trapped. I've been everywhere. The laboratory with the large glass tubes filled with formaldehyde. We haven't seen that yet. And those dark, wet and eerie caves. We haven't seen that yet either. What can I do? At first, I didn't want to believe my eyes, but that familiar high-heeled shoe in the corridor, it was like reflex. One name came to my mind, Jessica. I don't want to believe they share the same fate as me. No, I can't give up hope. I have to hope they're alive. I'm really sorry, Trevor, man. They ain't. November 30th, 1967. I haven't had anything to eat or drink for the past few days. I feel like I'm going crazy. Yeah, I wouldn't want to eat anything here either. The conditions in this establishment are just disgraceful. Why is this happening to me? It needs Gordon Ramsay to come in and kick some ass, quite frankly. Why is this happening to me? Why do I have to die like this? I was too obsessed with designing this ghastly... Oh, he's the designer! Trevor was the architect! This ghastly mansion. I should have known better. November November 31st, 1967. It was a dark and damp underground tunnel and another dead end, but even in the darkness something caught my eye. Carefully I lit the last match I had to see what it was. A grave, but deeply engraved into the stone was my name, George Trevor. At that instant it all became clear to me. Those bastards knew from the beginning that I'd die here, and I fell right into their trap. I mean, Umbrella are the most fantastic evil corporation ever, aren't they? Because like they're not only like totally uh, they just don't give a shit whether their viruses and bioweapons get out and start murdering people or transforming them into zombies or destroying entire cities and towns as they ultimately do. They also play these really cruel games with the people who work for them, and I rather appreciate that. If I had an evil corporation i'd run it like umbrella but it's too late now i'm losing it everything is becoming so far away jessica lisa we've met lisa forgive me because of my ego i got both of you involved in this whole damn conspiracy forgive me may god justify my death in exchange for your safety george trevor oh i mean her name is carved into the small gravestone oh Oh, do we have to? Oh! So he's not here. Unless he's a Zambro down there. We're going deeper underground, even. We need a bit of Jamiroquai going on here. We're going deeper. That's even nastier. It's just, it's just, oh, uh, it's ominous. And the music makes it worse. I love it. And Jill doesn't care because she, she's a psychopath. Okay, are we going to stop being British and prevaricating and go down? <gasps> of course we are clip. Oh no. You don't want to be underground. Oh fuck, what's that? Ah! Fucking hell! Fucking shitting bloody hell! Curses! Swear words! Shit! Oh, there's another one! Bloody b 
buggering hell that's they they those things scare me um i don't know whether you noticed ladies and gentlemen take it yes this is the map of the underground so there's stuff to find here um we've just got to be very careful because those th <laughs> leave me alone Ah, I'm not going to waste ammo trying to kill them because we don't need to come back here after this. So um, there's no point. I'm just, I'm just very wary of everything now. That's in case we get poisoned. Oh, hello. Is that uh, who I think it is? That could actually be George. <laughs> hello. Thank you very much. Oh, frig! There's a couple of them. Um. There you go. Oh, come on, just... That should do for you. That may have been a bit of a waste, actually. Um, but hey-ho, at least we've cleared the path. There are a number of small objects on the shelf. Looking closer, you notice the seal of Raccoon City on a broken dish. Okay. Oh. <laughs> As though that's any use at this point. You unlocked it. Way good, thank you. This is like the worst place. It is the worst place to be. It's horrible. Oh, look where we are! A bunch of spices you've never seen before. We're back in the kitchen! A piece of meat from an unidentified source. Well, that's cool, isn't it? But uh, we don't want to be in here yet, so that's the way out. That's the way back up into the mansion with the hunters and whatnot. Where we want to be is, uh, well, somewhere else, quite frankly. Anywhere else. I'd even prefer Silent Hill over this. At least in Silent Hill, you know that everything that you face is of your making. It looks like the power supply for the elevator. The main fuse is... Switch over, yeah. Ah! Oh, fabulous! Yes! Excellent! The elevator's working, which means we can get up to the... Um, we can go down. We can go down to the basement. Or we can head up. We can head up into the, uh, the other part of the mansion. Right up into the upper floor. Which is fabulous. That opens up an entire floor of the mansion for us. Mm. Those things are horrible. They're just grisly and disgusting, and they scare me. Uh, <laughs> inside the cardboard box lies the discarding shell of a molting spider. Uh, yes, we want that. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen, if, if, if you feel like I'm overemphasizing here, but these things, I'm just feeling like, I, I'm an arachnophobe, and I'm just feeling like that horrible, hideous, crawly sensation up my shoulders and spine. It's not pleasant. It's not nice at all. Right, that's that part of the mansion done. Good. Um, but did we go down this way? Yes, we went down this way. The way we didn't go is through here into the water, isn't it? Which is, um... No, 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 we did go this way. Let's head this way then and see what's down here. I just want to have a look. No stone unturned. Oh, yeah, we did go this way. Is there anything else out here? Or am I just being really thick and, um... Not getting where I am? Having no sense of spatial awareness. Nope, we're done down here. Good, 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 good. Unless we can go further that way. No, we can't. Good. Okay. We, we're we done down here, quite frankly. I never want to see this area again. Ugh. Horrible. That scared me. And the framing of that spider was fabulous. Right, we should be able to use the elevator now. Unless this... Oh, God, there was a corpse down here, wasn't there? Is it... Oh, no, it's gone. Good. Is that good? I'm not entirely sure. Is there something in the elevator? No. Good. There's still a couple of doors we need to unlock in the mansion, actually, but we'll come back and do that. Mm. I am actually a little bit scared, because I can't quite remember this area. I don't know what's up here. Oh, I do now. I remember it now. Hello! You really don't want to mess with me while I've got this my friend. Now, we've got the elevator there. Hello. You can have it too. It's probably not the best idea, um, wasting all of this shotgun ammo, but, um, a damaged statue of a goddess. But, uh, I rather like the shotgun, so... Sod off, quite frankly. Uh... 
you unlocked it. What what door is this? What door is this? I don't know. Where are we going? Oh! Oh, that's very useful. Oh, that's very useful. Have you noticed the music's changed? The music has gone a bit more eerie now. Um, to emphasise the fact that, uh, well, things are not as they were. Things have gone terribly, terribly wrong. Um, that guy... Oh, you fucker, there are two of them! Well, we may as well just kill them then. Because if we don't, they're going to be problematic, so, um... Oh, for... Is that the other one? Is that... Oh, oh, that's the other one. Okay, we can deal with one. One is fine. Um, now, let me think. Where do we... Oh, ooh, ooh, actually, actually, there is a room that we need to go to. Um, I'm trying to think what the best course of action is, actually. Let's go back through here and back through to that new area, because I want to explore all the rooms in there first. Before we do anything... <gasps> I know where the library is. I've remembered. I've got it. I've got it. I know where, you're, uh, where our next encounter is. Who the hell is keeping these braziers lit? I would very much like to know that. Unless they're gaslit, in which instance they're very dangerous, and the bill for this place must be astronomical by this point. <gasps> Always. Yes, please. Of course. Very nice. Thank you very much. That's a lovely room. The shelf is full of dust-covered props and a deer trophy. <gasps> yep, we want that too. Um, I think we will use that, yes, so we become fine again. That is essential. We need that for outside. That's very important. Now, before we start messing about with, um, well, our old friend, let's put it that way, I need to go store some stuff. Are you going to stay there? Or are you, you're going to get up as a hunter, aren't you? Of course you are. <sighs> Not as a hunter, as a crimson head. I'm getting my um, bio weapons mixed up. Click. Of course, there are going to be hunters through here, too. Of course, there are. And it would be best if we do kill them. The game at this point uh, hates you, the game hates your guts. Oh no, they're gone! Oh, the Zombros are gone! That's lovely. I thought they mutated into Crimson Heads at this point, but um, apparently the game realises just how essential this this area is, and uh, as a waypoint, it takes them away. That's that there, ladies and gentlemen. That is excellent game design. That is fabulous game design. Well done. Uh, this can go away. This can go away for the time being. Um, we won't need the battery for a little while, so we'll keep that there. I swear, ladies and gentlemen, you will not know relief um, like that when you're playing a survival horror game and you hear the safe room music. Of course, later survival horror games really pervert that notion and play with it, which I really, really like. Um, Resi 7 does it. Resident Evil 7 does it, which I will be playing, by the way. Now, I believe we can open this door now. Yeah! I believe there's a puzzle in here, and this is where we get the the yellow eye for the tiger statue. What was that? Oh, yeah, 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 I remember this. Yes. There's something else here, too. It follows you, so what you need to do... The, you see how the eagle follows us? It's a really bizarre puzzle, this one. Mail to the Chief of Security. Confidential. Attention. Chief of Security. Date, July 22nd, 1998. 2.13. X day is drawing upon us. Ooh, that's uh, ominous. Execute the following procedures within one week. Prompt actions are demanded. One, 
lure stars to the estate and obtain BOW's raw combat data against stars. So that's what we're here for, essentially. We've been lured here so that we can compete against the zombies and the dogs and all the other bioweapons, and Umbrella can record the data to see how, uh, how useful they are. Collect two embryos of each mutated specimen as samples, excluding the tyrant. Dispose of the tyrant. We haven't seen the tyrant yet, but we will. Ensure complete disposal of the Arclay Laboratory, including all personnel and test animals. Disguise their deaths as an accident. When the above procedures are executed, report to headquarters for further instructions. If for some reason you are unable to execute the procedure by the deadline, report immediately. In case of emergency situations, report directly to the extension number 5691. Alright? Good luck, Umbrella Headquarters, Umbrella Inc. Now, who is that memo to, do you think? Hmm? Who are they talking to? One has to wonder, doesn't one? It has to be someone here. It has to be someone who is present. It's rather curious, isn't it? Will you take the dagger? Yes. Now, let me think. There is a, a very specific way of doing this puzzle. I just can't quite remember what it is. I think this one goes up against here, if I remember correctly. I just cannot remember. Now we need to turn off this. No, no, no. Now we need to look. We need to look at something. I can't remember what the hell it is, though. So we've got... A glowing yellow jewel sits in the eye. Yes. It's attached to something and refuses to budge. Right. So I think what we need to do is draw the gaze of that and then very quickly... We need to draw the gaze of the, the eagle, and then very, very, very quickly get the eye. Shit, yep, yeah, that's it. That's how you do it. Ah, it's very tricky, though. There is a way of doing it. You can come back here, and then it stops. So it is, as long as we're quick, we can do it. Yes. Got it! <laughs> ah, sucks to be you. We got it anyway. I get terribly overexcited about these things. I don't know why. But now we can go through um, to that other room, the tiger room, and um, probably die horribly because there are soon going to be creatures pouring through this corridor. No word of a lie. Ah! Fuck! You see? The game hates you! You see, I told you those windows were going to be a problem. Oh, those things are great, aren't they? Look at the lizardy skin. They're fabulous, I love them. Oh, there's another one. I don't think we're going to be safe through here either, we're not. There are, there are either hunters or crimson heads or something through here. Yeah, zombies, that's fine. I can deal with them for the time being. I can deal with those fuckers. Jesus wept. But uh, we can do this now, and I believe... Oh, damn, we're in trouble. I believe um, this gives us an MO disc. Yeah, this is an optional thing in the game. Uh, there are three altogether. Um, I sincerely hope I haven't missed one, because if I've missed one, then um, we won't be getting the best ending to the game, and uh, one of the key characters is going to die. Uh, right, now we will go and store that, and we will heal ourselves, because if we don't, we're going to die. Quite quickly. And that would be... Um, well, it would be annoying. Get off. You're not that scary anymore. There are hunters around now, and you just... You don't really measure up against them. If it were a, uh, a dick measuring contest, the hunters would win. Where is it, by the way? I bet it's around here, isn't it? Oh, it's not. I don't know where it is. I don't want to know where it is. I want it to leave me alone. Okay. Oh, right. This can go in here for the time being. We'll swap it out for that. Um, we will put this in here. We will put... Uh, what we're going to do is swap the acid shells. Um, oh, can we unload the... Uh, oh, no, wrong one. That's why. Ooh, might have I forgot the right weapon, mightn't it? Right, we'll put the fire rounds back in here because those are going to be very useful against a particular creature later on, which uh, we haven't met yet. 
Okay. Use. Cool. We're fine. Excellent. Good. We're doing all right at the moment. How long that will last? I has. I don't want to know. Now, where's that hunter gone? Did he come up the stairs? He probably did. Oh, I can hear. Ooh. Can you hear him? There you are. Oh, get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Aha! <laughs> <laughs> Didn't like that, did you? Ooh, Twitchy! Are you dead? Are you dead? No. You will be. You dead? You dead? Ooh. Oh, God, they die dramatically, don't they? They die like a Shakespearean actor. There is one out here, but this one we can handle. Uh, as long as he's on the other side, we should be able to just leave him alone. I hope he's on the other side. Please be on the other side. I'll be annoyed if you're not on the other side. Ooh, that's a new noise. The old hunters never used to make that noise in the original, but I love it. Love it. I think it's great. There's a nice little optional room um, down here, which I believe we need the helmet key for. Now, we, you, I'm sure you actually don't need to go in here, but um, are we going to go in? Of course we are. What kind of survival horror player would we be if we didn't go into locked rooms? Even ones we don't need to go into. <gasps> uh, I don't want to know what that is. There's some kind of internal organ inside. You can't tell whether it came from a human or an animal. I, does it matter? There's something handwritten. It's not dated. Nothing's changed. I never thought that this room I designed as an experiment would pay off like this. I can hide here safely for a while because nobody knows about the secret behind this painting. Not even Suspenser. Painting of a mansion in the back of the art room. Okay. Oh, we know where that is, don't we? Could this be a telescope? It looks pretty old. An elaborately fashioned globe. Hello. Portrait of a woman. Sad look in her eyes. Uh, we... We will take the ink ribbon, yeah, because we may be able to use it later. So we want to look for the portrait of a mansion, which I believe we've already found. It was in one of the, uh... It's in the art room, which is, uh, over the way from here. We're back through the main hall. We'll go and have a look at that in a moment. Not yet. In a moment. Hello! <laughs> That's brilliant! Fabulous framing there. Fabulous framing. I love that. Are you dead? Ah, there's another one of those annoying puzzles here. And it is really annoying, believe me. Will you take the dagger? Yes. If this puzzle takes too long, I will... Um, I will cut it out, because it's, quite frankly, a bit annoying. Uh, will you take the jewellery box? Yes, I shall. Now, this puzzle... This puzzle can be a pest, actually. This is very much like a sort of point-and-click adventure puzzle. Um, how do you do this now? There's nothing unusual. Um, there's a little... There's a round recession... Uh, a round recession, right, okay. Do we have the means of, of... We don't, do we? We don't have the thing that goes in there. Right, so where is it? Where could it be? There's like a little... There's an item that goes in there. I don't quite know where it is, so uh, we're going to need to have a bit of a search for that, because I don't know what's in there, but it is, it's very useful. I just remember that. Where would it be? It's part... I seem to remember it being part of a statue or something like that. There's nothing in the drawer, so it's not in here. Sad looking her eye. Yeah, we got that. Sad woman, gotcha. Hmm. We'll have a, a bit more of a hunt around to see what we can find because that, that, um, whatever that is, it's it is useful. I remember it being very useful. I just can't remember for the life of me where the thing is. Damn it. Now that um, that journal did say in the art room, didn't it? So let's go and have a look. Uh, we may need to defend ourselves in here because there was a Zambro in here before. Let's hope he's still dead. 
Nope. He's a crimson head now. Look at the eyes. Ooh. If anything, I'd say they're even more deadly than the hunters, the crimson heads. Oh, he's good. He's good and dead. You see the spreading, uh, the spreading vitae underneath him. The the bit of claret. That means he's dead. Here's the the thing. An eerie picture of the mansion. So, that's what it was talking about, wasn't it? Is there something here? Something. Something we can do, maybe. Various art supplies. Hmm. It did say, didn't it? That that is what it said. Hmm. Peculiar. Peculiar. Now, before we do anything else, there are lots of places we need to go. Lots and lots and lots of places we still need to explore. So let's go do it, shall we? Back upstairs we go. Padding softly on that lovely plush carpet. I tell you what, uh, George Trevor, who designed this place, if he did the interior decor as well, I've got a lot of time for him. Even if he did design the really silly, hideous, stupid traps and locking mechanisms and whatnot, lots of time for him. You click away over there. You click away. That's actually a very pleasing sound. I really like it. Not going that way. Not going that way for love nor money. Oh, yes, we are. We will be in a moment because we've got to go that way anyway, so... <laughs> Ooh. That's... A fucking crimson head! <laughs> Jill! Don't reload now! Hopefully that's dead. Is it gonna bleed out? Oh, come on, bleed out. Yay! That's you done. Why is there a naked woman on the... On... Oh, please don't tell me that's the way you call the elevator. Do you, is there... Is some part of her anatomy the switch? That would be, um... Well... A bit much, quite frankly. Oh, absolutely, we'll take the green herb. Absolutely, we will. Um, combine, mit that, so we've got some space. Right. Let's have a look. There are a couple of rooms we haven't been... Oh, look at the moth! Isn't that fabulous? Fra beautiful framing there, I really like that. There's an oriental scroll on the wall, but the picture on it is western style. What? What? The knob is broken. Okay, so we come out this way. Hmm. Okay. That's curious. Very curious indeed. I think I know where we're going. This. Oh no, this is this is a closet. We <laughs> don't. We're not going this way. This is a closet. That's silly. Let's just sit in here for the rest of the game. I mean, that I, I'm totally up for that. Let's just lock the door, sit down with as much ammo as we can, and just blast the, the face off of anything that tries to come in. We're wreaking absolute havoc on the, uh, the, the, the creatures in this mansion. We really are. Now, before we do anything, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to be an absolute coward, and I'm going to go save my game. I know, I can't help it, I'm a bit, um, I can't help it with the saving, it's, it's an anxiety thing. I've got a horrible, horrible feeling that the next encounter will kill us horribly a number of times, and, um, I don't want to have to do all this again, quite frankly. Would be annoying. For all involved. Apart from Jill, who doesn't feel any emotions whatsoever, she just pretends to, because she's a psychopath. Running jokes, ladies and gentlemen. Running jokes. It is the key. Okay. Um, I think we can store that for the time being. We can store that. Um, we'll keep... Oh, God, we're running low on ammo there. That's not good. Um, we will save our game. It's an old typewriter. Is it indeed? <gasps> yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, actually, yes, because we've done everything there. We don't need that anymore. Chris likes Wesker. There we go. Okie dokie! Righty ho! We're gonna go, um... We're gonna need to boot up and suit up, quite frankly, because we are about to meet an old friend of ours. 
Okay, let's um, let's go see if we can do this. This um, it's quite a big encounter. This one, so let's see if we can do it. First of all, let's see if we can get there. I know the way there is 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 sodding difficult. So um, let's see if we can get there first, shall we? Hopefully, I mean, what I'm sincerely hoping is we could just run past everything without getting hit or chomped on or whatever. That would be phenomenally lovely. It really would. Not very likely, though, I'm afraid. Time to run like buggery! I'm happy that he's still a zombie. I'm happy that he's still a zombie, too. Uh, by this point, most of these guys have become those. Is it that one? No, it's not. It's the other one. It's the other one, you twat. God damn it. Then the crow's down there. And yes, they will attack us now, by the way. There is hardly a corridor or a space in this entire game now that can be described as even remotely safe. Right, remember this place? I remember when I first played this game, I got so horrendously lost uh, for the simple reason that I forgot that there was a door up here that we hadn't opened. Yeah. Um, it's very secreted. Um, and can you see all the, the filth and stuff? Do you recognize it? Do you remember what the last time we saw that? Yeah? <laughs> uh, yeah, what did we meet? What happened? You, you only get two guesses. Oh, it's, uh, it's, uh, oh, it's giving, oh, it's giving us health. It's giving us health. What does that mean, do you think? The framing is gorgeous, isn't it? Oh, fuck. What do you- oh! <laughs> It's Yawnsum! He's back, and he's not happy with us! Oh, Jill, you are... Shit, quite frankly. Oh, crap. Oh, stop firing at the books, you stupid woman. Crap. That's not good. Maybe should have bought a bit more ammo. Why is he running away? Ew! Oh! <laughs> oh! Did we get him? Oh! Yes, we did! Yes, we did! We've just killed the prettiest creature in the game. And that makes me feel wonderful. Are we poisoned? No, we're not. We're not even poisoned. Yeah. We're we doing badly in terms of ammo, by the way. But, um, yeah. Now, that there is a trophy. I would want that for um, my game room, quite frankly, if I had one. Chairs for browsing. You seem uh, remarkably au fait, Jill. Remarkably au fait given what you've just done. I look, it's even got, like, marks of the T-virus. Like, the, the 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 rents and the lesions and stuff all over it. That is fantastic. A collection of books on a broad range of subjects. There doesn't seem to be anything useful. Oh, okay. That's, uh, that's disheartening, isn't it? Uh, yeah. This is the only reason you come in here. Hey! Fabulous. That's it. That's all we came back for. That's pretty much everything in the mansion done. Uh... Yep, another copy of this book. And what's in here? It's the Wolf Medallion. Fabulous. It's exactly what we need. Um, right, what we need now is a storeroom. That would be uh, just lovely, quite frankly. Old books have fallen from the shelf. Okay. What was he doing in the library anyway? What exactly uh, was he hoping to achieve? The knob is broken. Oh. Oh, that's annoying. So we have to go back the long way. Uh, Alright, fine. In fact, that's okay, because um, I think after that encounter, we might give it a good old save, and... Um, yes, I think that's that will be it for this set. Let's, uh, let's get some health, because that's always handy. We'll combine these and we'll store them, uh, just in case we need them later. You know? 
Unless we want to, uh, you know, if we want to retreat back to that lovely room, the fire we, and the wine, and uh, get good and high. Don't judge Jill if she wants to get high. I mean, in in this situation, she can do whatever the hell she likes. I'm still. I want to know what that um, what that thing was all about with the. Uh, the painting in the art room of the mansion. I'm trying, I'm racking my brains trying to figure out what that's about. Oh well, if I can't remember, I'll figure it out next time. By figure out, what I actually mean is I'll go and look it up on the Resi Wiki. Oh, fuck. Is this a good way to go? Probably not. That said, there is a crimson head around here, so it's crows or crimson head, crows or crimson head. Hmm, I just can't decide. Crimson head, apparently. Get out of me way. Oh no! <laughs> That's not good at all. That ain't good at all. Ooh, look at him, look at him. <laughs> ah, so much fun. So much fun. I am in having entirely too much fun with this game, I really am. Now, if that wasn't the art room, what does it mean by the picture of the mansion? What, uh, if that wasn't the art room, then what was, what, what, what is? Because I can't, I can't quite remember what it's referring to there. I also want to figure out what the deal is with that, that case thing that we found. Because I can't remember that either, I may have to look that up. I have a funny feeling another MO disc is inside. If not, maybe something equally lovely. Right, we will store that lovely thing. And we will store that. And now we need a couple of things out, ladies and gentlemen. We will shortly need the crank. And we will shortly need the battery. Where's the battery? Where? What, what, what did we do with the battery? We will shortly need the battery. Um, and I think, because we, we are doing poorly with regards to ammo here, we'll put that away for now. And we will get out the pistol, because that has tons of ammo. Um, not as effective, but tons of ammo. And um, I think that will be it for now. Yes, until next time, ladies and gentlemen, when we will be heading outdoors again for more fun and games, and of course meeting lots of new furry friends. Bye!